Good morning. Now open your math book to page 999, please. Let's look at the first problem. Train A is carrying 200 people going 80 miles an hour halfway down a 92 mile track. Train B is carrying 200 ducks and doing 40 plus 1 mile an hour every time they hear one quack. Now simply take the differential of the numerator of the quotient of the people on train A divided by 9 and multiply it by the integer of the remainder when dividing by the rate that B accelerates assuming ducks a quack and average 1800 times a week and have a standard deviation of the rate of train A. All right, now let's try one a little more challenging. Madeline has 87 pomegranates and her cousin Riley has a $20 bin and 18 times. How many pomegranates can he purchase even though they're not for sale, which she has told him over 18 times? If every pomegranate is a quarter, then he has enough for all of them like anybody ever needs that much fruit. But even if she factors in the interest and depreciation of the advertised to value, that will get the answer still will come to zero. Because remember that we told you that the stupid pomegranates aren't even for sale. You should have gotten that one. I am disappointed. Now we have a nice surprise for you. It is a short pop quiz. Yay! Get a piece of paper out and put your calculator away. Write your name and the date. Number the page from 1 to 1908. Show your work the don't be slow. Ready, set, and here we go. 1, 82, and 94. Too late. Wrong. Next. 2, 108, and 49. Too late. Wrong. Next. 3, 29, and 98. Wrong. Next. 85, and 98. Wrong. Next. Wrong, 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 You're hopeless. I guess we have to start from the very beginning. Two and two. And two and two and two and two and two and eighty-four and seven hundred twenty-three divided by fifty. Plus thirty-seven minus fifty-two plus eight plus eighty-seven thousand times the market price of kerosene. Now add a hundred, round it up by ten, divide by forty-four, then put it in a nine by thirteen. 